Let's get some work done today. Open up, you open up. Hit you on baby and We should be closer than friends. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Just want to show you guys my hoodie. I got this from Kel Mitchell's website. Um, it comes in hoodies, tank tops, short sleeve, long sleeve, whatever you really want, however you want to dress um, down, because it's not really a dress up. Um, it comes in that. I got a black hoodie. I think I'm going to get... I don't want a white one because I don't want it to get messed up, but I want something where the hair is going to pop because the hair is there, but you can't see it on the black. So maybe blue, maybe blue. I don't know. We'll see. Um, today I wanted to come and talk to you guys. Look at my skin. I'm out here shining, 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 shining. Yeah. I started to up. I did. <clears throat> shining, 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 shining. Yeah. Nope. Still too low. Can't do it. All right. So, I wanted to talk to you guys. I have mad energy. I think that um, I'm going kind of crazy. I'm in the middle of the egg diet. If you know anything about the egg diet, all I've eaten for the past two days has been egg variants. Okay? So, today I had deviled eggs and egg salad. Because you can have mayo. So, that's what I had today so far. Um, for dinner, I'll probably eat the rest of the deviled eggs. Um, if I really want to be good, I'll save the deviled eggs and maybe I'll eat like a salad because that's really all you can eat besides eggs is vegetables. Um, I feel good. I, ha I feel energy. You see the dark spots are a little lighter. Skin's looking a little glowing, right? It's only been two days. I don't know why I have this kind of energy. I think I might be a little manic. We're not going to talk about it. Um, so what I'm actually here to talk about two minutes into this video, <laughs> I have PCOS as you all know we will talk about that in another video um, I have PCOS so my periods are horrible um, one thing that I read and that people have told me will help make I'm sorry give me a second I need lip gloss make your period more bearable is um switching to organic uh, pads the one issue that I ignore the mess in the background I really wasn't expecting to do this video but um the problem I'm I'm running into with um, organic pads size wings um support really right like it's just not it's not working for me okay so with that being said i decided to do some experimenting so this is good old faithful i know she works i stopped using her because i thought she was the cause of my uh yeast infections i was getting chronic yeast infections for a while it was really bad i really hated my life for a, a little while there in 2016 um so i stopped using her but this is good old faithful when I'm not using Always Infinity, Flex Form, blah, blah, I'm using um, just the regular Ultra Thin, Always Infinity, uh, not Infinity, Always Pads. Um, I always get the overnight pads because I'm a big girl. And I've been a big girl most of my life. So um, the extra small, small, medium, never going to hold me, never going to stay on me. And then on top of that, I need the support of being able to hold all this PCOS blood up in. I'm sorry, that is so graphic, but I have to keep it real with y'all. So yeah, um, I need something that's going to hold my heavy flow. That's a better way of saying it. Um, because my flow is always heavy and it's always heavy at the most random time. So when it first starts, it's very light, but very painful. Um, day two, it's extremely heavy and scary and I'm always like, do I need to go to the doctor? And then I'm like, you're going to pay a copay just for them to tell you what you already know. Um, I know some of you can relate. And um, day three, four, five, sometimes six, they vary. So like the last day is going to be just as light as the first day. And then everything in between can be really heavy or like nothing at all. Literally like nothing at all. So that being said, um, this has always been good to me. So... Um, this costs less than $7 at Walmart. I think at like a pharmacy it's like $10, maybe a little bit less. Um, we'll talk about this in another portion of this video. Right now we're going to talk about this guy and then, oh, so I need to show you everything that I have. Right, right. So there's this guy. This is called Ryle, 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 Ryle. 
<laughs> organics um cotton cover pads and we're gonna talk about this in a second um and then this is called always pure and it's supposed to be like chlorine free it's supposed to be organic it's supposed to be 100 percent cotton blah 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 it can't be 100 percent cotton i don't believe that about always i don't believe anything's 100 percent anything with always except for 100 percent my give you more cysts um but i still use it because it works and so you, you saw me hit myself what happens is i have to choose between does it work is it gonna make my cyst hurt um and so here i am right okay so basically i chose i chose to start using these uh a few months ago because i know that they will be long enough i know that they will keep me i think they've kept me overnight before we'll talk about it when I experience it so tonight I'm using these right I have this on right now because I just was anxious to see what it looks like inside 100% um, certified organic cotton cover chlorine free natural wood pulp core with super absorbent polymers waterproof backing polyethylene polypropylene it's manufactured in LA when you open it up it comes in a giant package right so this is plastic I was very afraid that I was gonna end up with just a pad but it's it's in a wrapping praise the Lord thank you Jesus I'm gonna show you they have the uh, the flap just like always some other people don't have that they have this other thing and it makes it hard to discard I just finished singing a bunch of dream girls so I'm a little <clears throat> in my bag um so when you open it up, it looks like so. They have what I like about it. First of all, it's super soft and cushiony. Second of all, um, this they have there. And then they have one at the bottom for the big girls with the big draws. And I really appreciate that, especially at night when you're sleeping and your body's moving all around and things are happening, right? So I'm excited to use this for my hands are clean. I literally just finished washing my hands. Um, so I'm going to use this one that I just opened tonight um, when I go to sleep. I just wanted to show you the packaging of it all. Now this is what it looks like op fully opened up. Can you see that? Okay. It says ultra thin pads with double wings. So that's what it's essentially looking like. So your back end is covered just like your front end. So if you have any... If you're like me and you have the cake sometimes there's some slippage but with that back end being that wide you get that coverage and I respect it so I'm excited for this I want to see how it goes I want to see how I feel I know that I've been using okay so okay here's so here's the other thing I'm trying to be so quick because I'm already late for work um the um pads I typically wear at night and or when I'm just at home and need to be like low maintenance um any other time actually i want to say around 2016 when i started getting the yeast infections from the other pads or from what i thought was the other pads um it really is just my body my body is very sensitive to fragrances and foreign objects and so my body was just like okay we're gonna give you a yeast infection now because um you put soap there and you weren't supposed to put that kind of soap there okay so um that being said, um, I my sister was like, I told my sister, you know, I'm going to the pool. I really don't want to put a pad on. It's so annoying. I'm going to be with my boo and I don't want to look crazy. So a couple years ago, she told me to try a tampon. I tried it. I, I had tried tampons in the past and I couldn't even get past the uh, application uh, process because it just was so uncomfortable for me. It's foreign and I didn't like it. I did it for the swimming I, I liked it for the purposes of swimming I tried it my next period as like a regular thing um, and since then I've been using tampons it helps me to not have as much cleanup and it helps me to control where everything goes so like even if I don't have a tampon strong enough to hold everything in if I use the tampon and a pad I don't have as much to clean up which I respect and appreciate um, and that is a problem for ladies with heavy flows heavier flows than what they create products to manage abnormal heavy abnormally heavy flows and so um on my day to day like today's my first day of my period because I don't know if it's going to be heavy light medium I have on a pad because I don't want to put 
a tampon in and then struggle to take it out because there's not enough blood on it. So instead what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the pad today. Tomorrow I'll try the tampon because it'll be heavier and it'll be just easier for me. Um, and yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I will be back to let you know tomorrow how this pad, the Ryle pad fared for my sleeping. I sleep kind of reckless, so this will help us to see that. I'm really excited to go on this journey with you guys. I think what I'm going to do is just do three different videos, right? So if you are interested in this series and want more series similar to this, let me know. I just FYI, I will not do a cup. I tried it. Uh, my body does not like foreign objects. So the cup doesn't really work for me. My my mental won't allow me to do the physical part. Um, so y'all pray for me. Thank you so much. Um, I was about to give you guys a closing, but I'll be back tomorrow <laughs> to let you know how this went. Thanks, guys. Let's get to the review of the, I still don't know if it's pronounced Rael, 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 but let's get to this. I wore this overnight. As you can see, there are four overnight. I wore it overnight. Let me read the box. This company was created for women by women. We are committed to sourcing the highest quality ingredients, developing innovative products, and offering easy access to healthy alternatives for women around the world. So they promise to have 100% organic cotton top sheet, super absorbent core, maximum airflow, leak locker technology. Remember, last night was not my heaviest night. So um, for last night, and in general, I think I, I, for last night, I really enjoyed this pad. As they said, there is great airflow. I forgot I was wearing a pad until I went to the bathroom this morning and then I was like, oh, yeah, period. Blah. Um, and I, I thoroughly enjoyed it. I think that it would do well on a heavier night. And so now that I know that, I'll try it on a heavier night on another night. Why? Because tonight we are going in with the pure by always overnight, right? Um, these look like this. I don't have this one on right now because it's day two. Y'all know, I told you, it's the heaviest day. So I start off with a tampon. Um, I'm not feeling the pain that I felt last month. So I'm assuming that that is attributed to uh i probably was passing a cyst last month and that's probably why it was so painful this month does not hurt i'm when i tell you it hurt the days leading to my period hurt and then it hurt for a week while i had my period it was horrible this month i feel a lot better this is tonight Let's talk about pure real quick uh pure always pure pads are free of chlorine bleach hypoallergenic cotton top layer free of dyes and fragrances so we all know I have the allergies so you see I hope you can see yeah you can see that right the picture okay so basically this one is not as long as the one that I showed you guys this one it's not as long it's not as much support it doesn't look at it doesn't look like as much support but we're gonna find out tonight uh, breathable hypoallergenic cotton top layer fast wicking core that keeps you dry and thin and flexible design I am going to I said I was originally gonna do a series but I'm not I'm gonna do it all in one video because um, then I can post the video next week for you guys I haven't posted in a few weeks last week it was the whole Rihanna Taylor thing I was it was beyond me this week I'm going through some personal stuff um, and it's a lot for me so I probably am not gonna have time to edit and post a video this week but next week will definitely be the week that you will see this video in particular I have filmed some other videos I have edited some other videos but I will wait to post those until after this one goes up um, Back to what I was saying about the tampon that I'm wearing. 
this is the tampon that I'm wearing. Looks familiar, doesn't it? Because Tampax and Always are the same company. Quiet as it's kept. So I get the pure Tampax Super, okay? Because let's be real. Um, pure Tampax Super and it says same thing free of chlorine bleach dyes and fragrances super absorbency handles heavy lifted meh, meh, meh. so it comes in a box like this i ordered three off of amazon i think i think i ordered them on amazon because walmart didn't have it so i ordered off of amazon um but this is what it looks like individually this is what i go to from day to day of my regular period ever since I started using tampons. Um, I started off with Pearl, which I think is also Tampax, um, but Pearl wasn't chlorine free. And if we're gonna insert stuff in our body, might as well be as healthy as it can be. So here we are, here, I don't know. There it is, that's what I meant to say. <laughs> I will be back with my review of the Always Pure. I don't need to review these because I use these all the time. If you would like to know about them, they're great. They're absorbent. When it says super, it means super. Anything else you want to know, comment below and ask, and I'll let you know. <laughs> but this video is specifically about pads, which is why I'm not going to go into detail about that. This is a yes for me. Go out, get it. This, we're gonna find out next, so stay tuned. Okay, so bear with me. Um, bear with me, my hair is coming out soon. Don't judge what's happening up here. It's been crazy. So, we were talking about my last day, right? And on my last day, I used Old Faithful. Old Faithful was Old and Faithful. Um, I can say that as much as I love this pad, and I think they show it to you on the box. Here, you see this? You see the shape? It has flex form, and they rave about flex format always. Um, and so you you get that. Uh, no leak certainty and it does you know it says 12 hours zero leaks leak free that's what it says i was leak free this entire period though so whether it be the rail the always pure or the always uh infinity flex form my entire period was leak free which hasn't happened in a long time but also as i told you earlier in this video my period has been a little different this time around right so um it, it was still heavy for like three days straight which is normal for me but um there was no pain and i think the pain always made it feel like i was bleeding way more than i was but then there were also times when i was bleeding way more than i bled this period so um that being said i that shape that we just that i just showed you versus this shape it makes a difference that this has this like rounded back part because that's where my hiney is and obviously the way your body is set up towards the front it it kind of your body like that part of your body kind of goes like this right your front half where your where your private part is is like this kind of and then towards the back it rounds out where your booty is and so because it's shaped like this I feel as though this gave me the most comfort this I had wedgies I had pad wedgies have you ever had a pad wedgie it's so horrific so like I'd be walking around with my client helping her get stuff grocery shop whatever and I would be like there's a pad in my hind part like it's so annoying so um if I had to choose my favorite of the three, it's definitely gonna be this one. Um, if I'm on a budget, it's definitely gonna be this one because this one gives you 30 pads for the same price as these two. 
this one comes with 10 this one comes with 18 so depending on where my money's at is going to depend on which one i buy but i love all of them this is definitely my favorite followed by this one and then this one there's nothing wrong with this one if i didn't rate them one two three i would rate them one and then two always is always and they're the same brand so i expect the same quality so for the third day i use this pad it tells you that it's a size five it tells you that it's 340 millimeters and and then it shows you the scale right and then i think on the box it said it super absorbent holes driest breathable top layer form fits form fitting roofs right um i don't know why i thought oh and then they have this thing called my fit i've been using always since i started my period when i was like 11 and it's my favorite brand i've tried kotex and whatever the other one is but always tends to have the best result um so that's why i use it um when i started with always they didn't have the my fit chart I just always knew that I needed the biggest one. So originally the biggest one was their number four, which was uh, orange, right? I remember having those big orange maxi pads and feeling like I had a diaper on, but also feeling like nothing was gonna get anywhere. So being super happy. Um, and then the overnight came out and when the overnight came out, they also had the ultra thin overnight and so that's what i would get until they came out with infinity and then i started getting infinity and then i started getting yeast infections and i thought it was from the infinity because they were saying that it wasn't made with cotton it was made with something else and i already know my body my body does not like foreign things and we've already talked about that so i'm not gonna go into a whole thing about that um so that was that with that and then um yeah that was that with that so i know i said i was only going to talk about those three um those three products and so now you know where i place those three products um i don't like to bash any company but i do want you guys to be aware when you're purchasing your organic or uh 100 cotton or whatever free padding um i want you to know what i know so if I've tried it, I want you to know about it. So the other brand that I do not recommend, please do not go out and buy this if you are plus size, okay? Um, if you are, you know, regular size, go for it. So it actually even says nine out of 10 women saw reduced skin irritation in just three months when using 100% cotton-like organic. So the brand name is Organic. Um, I didn't know that when I bought it, all I saw was the cotton logo and that's a brand that I trust. And so because I saw that, I said, let me try these and I'll show you the pad because I have one more left. Um, these are my struggle emergency pads, right? They have wings, um, but we talked about this before. So this I like, the, the, the material that they use, I kind of like because if there was any messiness it would kind of just stay inside the plastic which i think is kind of cool but look look yeah you see that that drives me crazy because when it's time to throw this pad out i have to use this stupid thing to dispose of it and you give me this kind of I'm not gonna be able to close that back up. It's gonna rip when I open it. And then when I'm trying to dispose of it, it's gonna pop open. Like, that's not smart packaging. So that was my first issue with it. My second issue with it is that it's, this is their, just wanna make sure, this is their heavy flow. So they have one stronger called the Super. Um, however, when I ordered it, that wasn't available. The highest one they had available was heavy and the heavy flow was just not for me even on my lightest day it didn't give me the coverage i needed the um the adhesive that's on the back of the wings wasn't sticking to my underwear and it was just not a pleasant experience so i've had this for a while because i only use it in case of emergencies 
or if I'm on my very, very last day when I know I'm probably just gonna spot a little bit and I probably should just use a panty liner, but I refuse to buy panty liners, that's when I was using these. Um, so yeah. Um, I think that it sucks that just because I'm a woman, I have to buy pads and I have to buy things for, for that purpose. I think it's annoying. Um, I know that it's a part of life and I'm, there's n it's never going to change and I'm fine with that. I just think it's annoying. Um, and so because of that, I, um, I just have some, some beliefs like panty liner is unnecessary. I'm not buying it. I don't recommend this brand. Um, everything is not for everybody. If you want to try it, try it, but I don't recommend it. Um, you saw the packaging. If you're about that life, more power to you can't do it give me this flap right here that is almost like tape right and they even give you that end that is not sticky so you can lift and then you can put it back together and that is glorious I love that and every single one of these pads had the exact same type of opening and closing piece tape thing so that's that on that thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you learned something i hope it helped you in some way um please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye